The following is classified level row. Unauthorized access is punishable under the GTVA Security Act, Deneb Convention, Section 2135. We vanquished the Shivans in the Great War, but the hard questions remain. How would we confront the threat of future invasion? The Shivans might return at any time, any place, without warning. How would we fight the next threat to the very existence of our species? In 2345, on the 10th anniversary of the Shivan attack on Ross 128, the Vasudan Emperor Khonsu II addressed the newly formed GTVA General Assembly. The Emperor inaugurated an ambitious and unprecedented joint endeavor, the GTVA Colossus. Together we built a civilization in the ruins of the Great War. And now we stand on the threshold of a new era of prosperity and harmony. In Project Colossus, the Vasudan people celebrate a renewed covenant of peaceful coexistence and mutual defense of our territories. The Colossus is the most powerful space-faring warship ever constructed. Spanning six kilometers from bow to stern, the Colossus has taken over 20 years to complete. Twelve Lucifer-class destroyers can fit within its massive hull. Its state-of-the-art weaponry includes 45 laser turrets, 15 flak guns, 12 missile batteries, and 12 beam cannons. The Colossus wields more firepower than five Orion-class destroyers combined. 60 fighter and bomber wings are housed in its vast hangar, and its crew numbers over 30,000. Among its major contractors are industry giants Triton Dynamics, Subak Innis, and the Akaton Corporation. The Alliance now wages war on multiple fronts. In Deneb, Alpha Centauri, Epsilon Pegasi, and the mysterious nebula beyond Gamma Draconis. Once deployed, the Colossus will end these conflicts swiftly and decisively. If ever the Shivans return to threaten our worlds, we will be ready to face the challenge, securing peace for today and for generations to come.